The birth of the Toshiba brand dates back to 1873. In this period when Japan's modernization process continues rapidly, Hisashige Tanaka is assigned to develop telegraph equipment for the Ministry of Engineering. Tanaka tries to meet this task with the limited resources of the time. Two years later, a new factory is established in Tokyo. This factory, named Tanaka Sizosho, will lay the foundations of Toshiba. At the time, another Toshiba founder, Ichisuk Fujioka, started working with William Ayrton, who was an expert in telegraphy and electric lighting when he was just 18 years old. As a result of these studies, he succeeded in developing Japan's first arc lamp in 1878. This success was of great importance for Japan, which had to import all its electric lamps until that day. In 1884, Fujioka met Thomas Edison during a trip to America and said that he was committed to the founding of the Japanese electric power industry. After returning to Japan, he began to manufacture prototypes of incandescent light bulbs and founded his own company, Hakanetsusha, in 1890. Hakanetsusha developed incandescent bulbs, making them more economical and durable. These bulbs significantly reduced the dependence on Europe and America in electric lighting. Ichisuk Fujioka, by establishing the electricity industry in Japan, brought the Japanese into the electric age, so to speak. Tanaka Sizosho, which he founded after Tanaka's death, was renamed Shibora Engineering Works in 1893. A name change also occurred in Hakanetsusha in 1899, and the company henceforth continued as Tokyo Denki. Then these two companies merged and formed a company. They laid the foundations of Toshiba by combining their experience in the two companies. Tasaba not only created new products, but also pioneered the development of new technologies. It not only expanded its existing factories, but also succeeded in turning these factories into large RVED centers. In parallel with the growth of the market, the company's sales and profitability level increased rapidly. The 1970s were the years when Toshiba opened to the world market. In these years, when international trade developed and multinational companies launched new sales channels, technology companies started to catch consistent growth rates. While the effects of the oil crisis continued, the competition between technology companies started to become the driving force of the market. The products developed by technology companies provided great savings in energy and labor costs, increased the quality in production and increased consumer satisfaction. Toshiba's rise in the world market with electronic products continued with innovations in information systems. Becoming one of the world's leading technology brands in a short time, Toshiba continued to grow steadily in the 1980s. Toshiba products have managed to stay ahead of their competitors not only with their high technological features, but also with their ergonomic design, durability, and robustness. Toshiba's product lines today focus on computer solutions, imaging systems and printers, memory and storage solutions, and other business units. Among the computer solutions, business purpose computer solutions and mobile devices that are suitable for the needs of the workplaces come to the fore more. So what do you think about Toshiba? You can express your thoughts in the comments.